They are cute and cuddly. They are restless but hopeful that one day they will find a home. But a budget cut threatens their hope. We were disappointed to hear that um, our community is looking to spend less money on animal services within this community. One third of the Lane County Animal Services funds have been cut. Due to the cutback, the shelter is being forced to close doors. What's being done to ensure animal services remain a priority? Lane County is currently accepting bids from private entities to take over the shelter. Green Hill is one of the organizations that has placed a bid. It's a challenge to, to care for an animal that is foreign to the, to the shelter, has no idea why they're there, just wishes they'd be back home, um, and, and they can't tell us where they're from. If Green Hill Humane Society wins the bid, they will take on 2,000 more animals than they are used to, doubling the size of their operations. To accommodate this change, Kerry says they will expand their facility and hire employees currently working for the Lane County Animal Services. The Lane County will announce the name of the highest bidder this July. Meanwhile, the little furry ones continue hoping to find a home during this adjustment. To make sure your furry friends don't end up in a shelter, get them a name tag and if possible, microchip and license them. For Oregon News, I'm Meryl Basit. Oh, cute boy.